Hi, my name is Keith Hall. Welcome to another NASC Minute. As we've moved past, at least hopefully past, the era of COVID, uh, many things have changed. Uh, we're looking for a new normal. Uh, who knows what that new normal is going to be, but I'm confident we're going to get there. I think one silver lining that we as small business owners uh, have found out of this pandemic period that we've, that we've lived through is that most of us uh, never had a banking relationship. Uh, we don't go down to the bank other than to get cash or to deposit our checks. Uh, with the PPP program, uh, many small business owners got loans for the first time from the government. Most of those loans have been forgiven, which was a fantastic opportunity, great benefit for small business. But it also put us in position of visiting with our local bank. Those banks managed the PPP program. They made the loans to us. They serviced those loans, and they help us forgive those loans. Uh, as we went through that program, a lot of us recognized that having a relationship with a local banker can be very beneficial. If you haven't done this yet, take some time over the next few months, go down to your bank and introduce yourself to the, the branch manager, to the loan officer. Uh, sit down with them and let them know something about your business. Uh, take in a financial statement. Let them know what your long-term plans are. Then once a quarter, maybe twice a year, sit down with your banker and give them an update on your small business. Because you never know, one day you may need a working capital line of credit. You may need to borrow $10,000 even to meet payroll because you have a big account receivable that's outstanding. There's gonna come a day that having that banking relationship can make a big difference in the growth of your small business. So it may seem strange, but don't wait until you need a loan before you go to the bank to ask for a loan. So set up that relationship, let them know about your business, let them know about your successes, not just about the times that you need money. Then when the relationship flips and you need them to help you, it's gonna be much easier for them to meet your goals. So find that local banker, introduce yourself, uh, don't be a stranger and build that relationship. Now you may have other questions, we're here to help. So bookmark our website at nasc.org and always remember, you're not alone.